It has been a while. <laughs> oh gosh, I haven't done this in a very long time. You may know what this is. For the people that have been with me since the beginning, kind of the beginning, well since the beginning, like 2017, 18, 19-ish, since 2018, 19, you know what I mean? For those that have been with me since 2017, 18, 19, and the new people that probably don't know what this is. So, if you have watched these videos. Alright. Hello everyone, my name is Lee Get Getting to my intro. Hello everyone, my name is Lee Azon. Know about a YouTube name, real badass Savage 2000. What's up my badass like gang 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 slash squad? Yes, I am back with, I have, I am back with a video. I have not done this a lot. Music. Just. Anyways. I have not, this is my first rant video in a year. I have not done a rant video in a whole year. If you have known, if you have watched the video, I released a rant video back in August 1st, 2019, ranting about the James Cameron movie, Avatar 2 and the sequels and all that. I would suggest you go watch that, or I'll leave a link in the description. You could go watch my last rant video from a year ago. This is my first rant video in a whole freaking year. So I'm finally back, and uh, the reason why I'm not being jolly with this is a rant video. And this rant video is going to be very serious and very on topic. And I hope you could really watch this video and share it with people that you know. We need to shadow all the freaking haters that are out there in this. And bring your piece up and I'll do... Oh. Anyways, if you notice the little part, I'm giving you part, honey. I'm giving you scalp. I'm giving you, I'm giving you scalp. I'm giving you realness. I'm giving you natural hair. What if I should go outside like this? I'm giving you natural hair. I'm already dressed for the day. Cause I may go outside today. I have plans to go this All right, that's besides the point. Um, welcome back to another rant video. Oh my god, I haven't done this. Welcome back to another rant video. And today, the topic that we're going to be talking about is very serious. We're going to be talking about people. Degraded other people because they have different preference whether they gay straight bi trans queer All that basically judging people by their differences Degrading people make them feel like they're not human. It is disgusting <laughs> That shit is disgusting. I'm just saying that's disgusting make few people like they're less worth than nothing Making people feel like they're nothing. That's horrible. That's disgusting. That's wrong Ugh. Eh, that's disgusting. We don't do that in here. We don't degrade people, right? I had personal experiences with those type of people over the summer and into now. I have experiences with those type of people. So we're going to get right up in this piece and do it. So we're going to talk about it straight up. So I'm going to tell you my experiences of what happened over what happened to me this summer. Someone made me feel like that as well. Someone made me feel like I, I can't be who I am. Judging me who I am because I have a different preference to everyone and all that bullshit makes I'm gonna press this video because it what do you think? What do you think is gonna happen here on this channel? Alright. Alright. I had a personal experience where people degraded me, make me feel like I was like I was nothing and like disrespect me. It was it was horrible. Alright, so alright, so I that day, this was back on July 18, 2020. So basically, on July 18, 2020, I was on Instagram, blah, blah, blah. I was a little irritated early that day. Okay, I was a little irritated early that day. I don't know, I was irritated by something. I don't remember what it was, but it's besides the point. So yeah, I was irritated that day. And then, I I don't know, I was on Instagram. You know me, I'm on Instagram, like artists post, slaying, doing my thing, talking to friends. And then I get a DM, then I decide to look, uh, to request. And this person straight up wrote. This per this person is short. I'm sorry. Give me a second. It's a lot. It's a lot still. Alright. This person straight up wrote that I was disgusting. I was disgusting. Call me in. Mm. I don't say that word. I don't hate that one. He called me a fag, basically. F-A-G. He called me F-A-G, basically. He called me F-A-G. He called me, I'm disgusted, make us throw up. I called, he called me, 
called me a bitch, he called me fuck you, he called me this, he called me that. It, it was a lot. I don't remember half of what he said. But I knew he called me bitch, I knew he called me, I'm disgusted, I'm making throw up. He called me the ugliest bitch in the world. I don't know. It was a lot. But basically, he called me that all that shit. And you know I'm not gonna hit. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something about myself. You know I'm not gonna tolerate BS up in here. You know I'm not gonna tolerate that BS. So I clap back. I'm not gonna let nobody disrespect me and get away with it. I'm not gonna let nobody disrespect me and get away with it. So I clap their ass back. And he didn't expect me to clap back. And he stopped bothering me after that. After that, he stopped bothering me. I never heard from that dude motherfucker again. I never heard from that motherfucker again. Basically, after I cursed his ass out and made him feel like a bitch. After I made him feel like a giant hoe. After I made him feel bad. Because he thought he could get away with the shit and get away with me because I have an innocent face. Just because I have an innocent face doesn't mean you can mess with me. I will clap back. Drag your ass. Beat your ass. Don't play with me. Just saying. Don't play with me. I, I don't play no games. If you disrespect me, I disrespect you back. Tower, don't play. Alright. Alright. So basically... He went away with his little shit. He hasn't come back since then. He has never bothered me. Now, to the other experiences that I had. To the other experiences that I had. Um, I had disrespectful people come saying. I had, I had more disrespectful people. That clap back and put them in their place. And they say they were sorry. They're sorry. They're sorry after that. They say they were sorry. They'll never do that again. And they never did do it again. Except for one person. I'm going to blast him. I'm going to say his name on camera. I don't care, all right? I said what I said. And I said what I said, what I said, I said what I meant, period. All right? Now, I said one person. We're going to talk about him in a minute. Now, now, I have people come up in my, in my shit saying, oh, boys don't have long hair, which was stupid. Oh, why are you bisexual? Yeah, that was the one. I don't know. I had people come up in my spot saying this, that, and the third. I can't remember what they said, but I could tell you half of what they said. Oh, why are you this? Why are you ugly? Why are you that? Why blah, 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 blah. Like, oh, shut up. Like, shut your hole. Like, shut up. I'm like, shut up. Because, number one, I'm not going to tolerate BS. Number two, shit. I got people on, on my side that will come for you and drag ass by your weave. Or by your little fucking strands of little fucking hair. Alright? So, all I'm saying, I had experience... Okay. So, I'm just telling you guys, I had experience with Summer with disrespectful, disgusting people. Disgusting people that just want to bully you. That just want to make you feel like you're not shit. You're not worth it. Let me tell you... No, 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 no. I got a message for you guys. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, guys. Don't let nobody come up in your DMs. Or come up to your face and tell you you're not worth shit. You are worth something. You're worth than you're worth more than you're worth more than everybody. You're worth more than these scumbags. You're worth more than these hateful people because you will outshine them. You will out go. Sorry, you will outlive them. You will outdo them because you're smarter. You know your own worth. You better. You know your own worth. That's all I'm saying for men and women too. And gay people and everyone in the LGBT community. You're worth everything. You're worth what you are. Alright? Keep that in your brain. You're worth what you are. Don't let anybody come and disrespect me. They disrespect but beat their ass. Alright? I don't care. I'm saying beat their ass. Curse them out. Or or move on and talk, say talk to the hand. Shit. Alright? You know your worth, everyone. Please know your worth. Don't let nobody come up in here and disrespect you. Because I don't tolerate. You shouldn't tolerate neither. Don't. Because... A bullies on social media and these playful, disgusting people come up on social media bothering these kids because they're gay, because they're ugly, because they're this. They just want, or they just want to make them feel like shit and make them feel like they worth nothing. Basically, they want to make them feel like they are not worth anything. And come up there. Some of these kids are young, like 12, 13, 14, 15, 11, 12. I get bullied so bad and, men and mentally does something to them. They want to they wanna end their own lives. Some of these kids have committed suicide. Some of these kids have killed themselves. 
over hateful and disgusting people like on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, whatever social media there is. They come up your spot and bother you and make you feel like you're not human. They make you feel like you're not human. Those people are sick. Disgustingly sick. That would make you throw up. Because don't let no... Don't let nobody make you feel like you're not worth nothing. You are worth something. And that is on period. You will always be that bitch. And you will be that bitch for life. You will always be that person. You will always be that badass. You're a boss bitch. You're a badass. And that is on period. And you're worth something in this world. Don't let nobody say you ain't worth nothing in this world. Seriously. I want to talk about petty people too. Let's talk about the petty people. Now petty people. Y'all so petty. Jealous, jealous, petty people. Let me tell you something. Ignore jealous and petty people that just want to talk shit. Don't let them get to you. You say, bitch, would you say? You. Or you could just say, well, excuse me, what did you say to me? I'm like, Noth they're like, nothing, nothing. Thought so. And become up for your life. <laughs> or like, don't play with me because I'm not the one to be playing with. Just say that, all right? Or whatever you want to say, just say don't don't just come up being don't come in here and disrespect me. I am worth something. Say I am worth something in this world, and that is on period. You say you're worth. Mm, you say you are worth something in this world, and you're worth everything that you are. Just say to that hateful person, you make me sick. I don't want to hear that. I'm worth something in this world. You're not because you have a miserable life. I'm worth something, and that is on period. Goodbye, sir. That's what you say. Not in an angry voice, but you say it in a passion. You say it in a passion that you're worth something in this world. Don't let nobody come up here and disrespect you. Don't let them come up here and disrespect you. That is on period. I, just, I don't know. Those type of people make me sick and they make me mad. They make me mad as hell. They make me mad as hell. I don't know what the title of this video. <laughs> We're just gonna be talking about dis ranting on disrespectful, making pe making people feel like they aren't human, and I don't know. All right, I don't. Know. God. All right. All right. The last thing I want to talk about another experience that I have from my own best well, not best friend, but he's my friend, not my best friend, but he's my friend. He's my friend. I'm gonna put him on bass. His name is Dominic. His name is Do his name is Dominic. All right. His name is Dominic. I'm not mad, but I am a little mad. I'm not gonna go off like I did. I'm just gonna tell you something, and this is advice to you. Don't be those type of people that just judge people for what they are. You're my friend, and you decide to judge me. You decided to come up in my shit. You decided no, no. You decided to come up in my text message and say, "What do you? Are you get? Do you? Are you gay? Yes or no? Or something like that." And he, and I told him I was bisexual. And I have told this. I'm. I am bisexual. If y'all don't know, um, basically I told him who I am. Blah blah blah. You call me gay, gay boy. You can like. I had to come up in here and talk some shit to that boy. He's like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, bro, I'm sorry. Like, yeah, you better be sorry because you don't come up in here and start disrespecting me for no reason. Just because I have a different preference than other people. I have a different preference. That's none of your business. If you don't have to like it, you don't have to like it. I'm just saying, Dominic, you don't have to like what I, you don't have to like that I'm bisexual. I like men and women. You don't have to like it. Nobody has to like it. But if you disrespect me, if you don't like it, clap out then. Pop out, cause, cause if you dis, I'm just saying, Dominic. If you disrespect me or any on one that disrespects me, I'm popping you out of my life. That is on period. Uh, cause I'm not gonna deal with disrespect, and that is on period. I'm just saying, cause just because just because you don't like the preference, just because like just because you don't support who I am, you don't have to like it. That's all I have to say. Now, one more thing before I have to go. Now, if I don't know if you heard me earlier, but I'm going to tell you. 
He sent me a voicemail like two, not voicemail. It was a voice message on Instagram when DMs were there. Voice message. He sent me a voice message saying this dumb question and this rude question. I know it's just a question, but it's rude. It's rude and dumb. All right. He said, why are you bisexual? I'm looking at the message like, huh? What did you say? I had to read that. I had to hear that message again. Why are you bisexual? I never answered that boy's question. Like, let me tell you something. That's a dumb question. That is a dumb question. Do not ask me that question again. All right? All I'm saying, do not ask me that question again. All right? Thank you. All right. So I said what I had to say about these disgusting, these people. I had to say what I had to say about hateful people. Let me just tell you one more message. Remember in your brain, you're worth something in this world. Work hard. Don't let nobody talk smack to you. You keep working through. Keep persevering, keep persevering, keep working. You know that these, you know you will outshine these hateful, negative, bitter people. You will outshine these negative, hateful, bitter people. All right? Just telling you. You're, you're that bitch. You will always be that bitch. And that's it. I said, I said what I meant. I said what I meant. Period. Alright? Alright, so I know this video is long as <laughs> freaking gosh. I can't. Alright, so thank you for watching. Please listen to this video and this message is in this video. I'm posting all of my social media platforms. Alright, thank you. Alright, thank you to everyone. Thank you guys. Alright, thank you all for listening. Subscribe, hit that notification bell, and join the badass fight gang 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 slash squad. Or you could be you don't have to be called gang, you could be called squad. That's why it says slash squad. Subscribe, hit the location bell, and join the um join the Bass Fight Gang Gang Slash Squad or Slash Libra Squad, whatever you wanna. Comment down below and tell me what you think of this video. Hit the like button, share my channel around with family, friends, and more, and I will see y'all. Oh, I will see y'all in the next video. Thank you for watching. Have a blessed day, guys.